After the lamentation and reproach, Harry made a new move that made the British royal family beware. Prince Harry is becoming the focus of media attention when he is petitioning the Home Office to provide security for the Sussexes when they return to visit their homeland. The Duke of Sussex insists he feels unsafe bringing his two children home because England is still his birthplace. In addition to asking for security with a fervent desire to bring his family back, Harry recently made another unusual move. According to the Telegraph, the lease term for Frogmore Cottage will end on March 31st, and Harry has decided to extend it to March 31st, 2022, i.e. an additional year. Frogmore Cottage used to be the residence of the Sussex family before they left the royal family to live in the U.S. The couple spent £2.4 million to renovate and upgrade Frogmore Cottage. After moving to the U.S., Harry and his wife still decided to pay the monthly rent of Frogmore Cottage even though the couple was not here. Currently, Princess Eugenie and her husband are said to be living at Frogmore Cottage to help the Sussex family take care of the house. Many internet users were surprised at Prince Harry's lease extension when he and his wife once announced they would not return to work for the royal family. However, experts who study the British royal family believe that Harry extended his lease for a different reason. With Harry having a specific and permanent residence in the UK, the prince will be eligible to be able to support the Queen of England as one of her four advisors. As a rule, the Queen's four advisors are four adults who are in the first rows of the British royal line of succession. There is also the spouse of the head of the royal family, Prince Philip, but he has passed away. These four advisors must all be in the UK, or have their domicile in the UK. They can act on behalf of the Queen in some matters when the Queen is temporarily absent, for health reasons, abroad. Currently, there are four people who qualify as advisors to the Queen, Prince Charles, Prince William, Prince Harry, and Prince Andrew. Currently, Mr. Andrew has been disgraced because of a scandal related to sexual abuse. Therefore, many experts believe that Harry is finding his way back to support the Queen of England regaining her place in the royal family after a while in the U.S. Harry's recent moves all show that he wants to return to his homeland. Recently, Harry was also seen attending an event with his cousin, Princess Eugenie, a sign that his connection to the royal family is still extremely close after many controversies. Meanwhile, many people think that Harry's sudden turning of the car, showing interest in returning is an unusual sign. Before that, the Duke of Sussex repeatedly lamented his family and national media, calling it a toxic environment. Therefore, the fact that Harry wants to come back here is definitely a plan behind, which may make the Duchess Kate and the royal family be wary. Prince Charles's birthday nightmare with Harry and William that was masked by smiles. The smiling and happy photos of Prince Charles's 70th birthday from three years ago are misleading as the party was actually a nightmare according to royal biographers. Prince Charles was pictured smiling ear to ear at his 70th birthday celebrations three years ago. The Prince of Wales marked his special milestone with a family photo shoot alongside sons Prince William and Prince Harry, his wife Camilla, and daughter-in-laws Meghan Markle and Kate Middleton. Louis, George and Charlotte were also pictured in the joyous photo. The royal family looked extremely relaxed and happy, but royal biographers Omid Scobie and Carolyn Durand claimed the shoot was a tough one to get through.